Quest. Hello friends, Greg here from Play With Greg. And at the request of twoplayergames.org, we are checking out Ragdoll Games. I haven't actually played this yet. I'm going to play it in real time with you people. Just as soon as we test my uh, stream this for a sound. <laughs> well, there's a commercial sound. That's for sure. That I don't want. There you go. The sound works. That's beautiful. Let's get to it. Who's all watching? I see some viewers already. <laughs> this is interesting. Uh, if you're not familiar with two... You can play in your web browser on your computer. I'm playing on Windows 10 right now. There is a single commercial before the game. And then once you get started... Uh, there are no ads, no pop-ups, no commercials, no nothing. You can just play. So we're going to do that. So that's our dude right there. Looks like we can pick who we want. Whenever you play a game from twoplayergames.org, she's cute. We'll use her. You'll notice they're not the same old-school two-player games of the past. They are fully realized uh, 3D games with uh, smooth frame rates. Uh, sharp resolutions and uh, they're usually a lot of fun to play so that's super cool hello there I am Ryan and I'll be helping you out press the next button <clears throat> you can pick up and throw objects like stones or coffee cups I want a uh, rubbish I love that love the English love English English Oh, look. Again, look how cool this is. It's a fully realized, like, 3D world. Find pickable objects around and destroy the thieves in the neighborhood. Use the C key to pick up and throw. Use the left shift button to run. Well, we can totally do that, and uh, we are about to do that. Let's do it now. Let me click on let's go, but the camera is moving so much. There you go. Interesting. Well, there's a, th a thief right there, but we want to pick this up, right? And smash him in the face. I didn't pay attention. I apologize. Can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> oh no, I'm so sorry. I wasn't paying attention. Pick this up. Oh, that's not fair. I need a tutorial to come back. Leave me alone, dude. I need to pick up some rubbish and throw it at you. That right there. <laughs> I did it. I did it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I have a rock. I do have a rock. So there's the red target in front of me. <laughs> I think this is adventure mode. I think the other mode is like a fight. <laughs> so this is a little different. Oh, there's a run button. Got it. Yeah, right in the head. Right in the head. Oh, well done. I eliminated all the enemies. And uh, move on to the next level. You've unlocked a new skill. Oh, punch and kick. All right. Punch and kick are a little bit. Uh, away from the directional keys. I'd rather punch and kick be like, say, Q and E. Because I can just take my. My. Uh, 
these two fingers and just pop them up to Q and E to punch while I'm left and right as well. B and B are kind of out of the way. But uh, we're going to make this work. Oh, Lord. <laughs> so I have to punch them off the building if I understood correctly. And oh, no. Oh, she's a girl. She needs a girl sound effect, guys. Come on now. I'm using a female character. Give her a female voice. I mean, it is female, right? You're wearing pink. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. I thought I got rid of her. I'm going to use two, uh, two hands here to help me do better. No, 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 no. Get up. Nice. They really go flying, which is nice. Oh, she did like a little kip up. <laughs> oh, someone do like a running drop kick or something. I, let the, I did the camera controls with the mouse. So that's fun. Oh, darn. Get up. I, I am so bad at this. Funny is I'm usually bad at, at these games, and then after a little practice, I do better. He's gone. He's there. oh, I love the scream. See that one was correct. One more to go. I'm not too too thrilled at having to knock him off the roof, but I think my technique is just no good. I don't think it's as hard as I'm making it. Okay. Okay. This is it. He needs to get up a bit because I need to get some height. I think that's my problem is he's so close to the to the wall that I can't get the height that I need to set him flying over the wall. And right now he's kind of stuck. I'm gonna beat him down. There he goes. No, wait, what? I don't totally appreciate having to start over like that. That was tough. I think getting the two or three out first should have been enough for that level to be complete. And then I could move along. What is this? Level select. One or two. So I... Let's do two. Round one. Oh, interesting. Check it out. Impressive. Oh, nice. Impressive. Oh, this is so much better than the other mode I was just playing. Impressive. It's hilarious. It's much more responsive. Impressive. Oh, a weapon. I threw the rubbish at him, which is hilarious. He's down. That's oh, okay, oh, but I want that uh that whatever that Round is. Round two. Impressive. Excellent. Excellent. He's got his sword again. You can bash him in the face, but it's not quite the devastating, uh... Oh, gross. You know, the devastating, uh... Round smack in the face that is an adventure mode where you hit them in the face and they straight up just die. Excellent. A little replay going on of my... Weapon victory here because I don't know if it'll happen again. Yeah, oh, yes. It, it is happening again right now. Are you ready? There you go. KO.
Player CPU wins. No, I won. It says we both won. Come on now. Don't do that to me. No, I won. Let's see what we can do with uh, the adventure mode. I'm not one to give up uh, so easily, but um, I'm really struggling with this mode. I want to work the camera with my right hand and play with my left, but the VB buttons are really out of the way. Oh, wow! So I feel like using a second hand is helpful. Come on. The second guy uh, seems to like to get stuck by this door. He did it in the last game, too. Come on. Yep. Come on. You're done. Yep. I wish the first wave was enough to have this level considered completed. Especially since it's so early in the game. Oh. <laughs> I would love a uh, like a like a impact sound, you know, like when I hit the ground. I would love uh, some form of impact because the falling itself is hilarious. I'll leave it to twoplayergames.org to have a ragdoll type game um, in a time when ragdoll type games are kind of popular. You know, Gang Beasts and whatnot, a few other games that are have a similar ragdoll style fighting. So, uh, of course they've got their own. Of course they do. <laughs> I think it's zero dollars. And there's like no annoying pop-ups, no annoying ads. Uh, really can't beat it if you want something just to mess with when you have some time to kill. Come on. Get out. Oh, man. I wish there was a slightly more dependable way to send them flying like an uppercut button or a throw button. <laughs> oh, off he goes. Two of them is okay. Um, three of them is tough to manage. There's only level two. One's done. I was going to say, if I can get down to two, I can manage. Then you knock one down, work on the other one, getting them out. Three is tough. like to hide in these corners. They really do. He's done. No, 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 no. No, this is only one level still. And if I lose, I gotta do it again. Guys, you're just really asking for rage quits to happen here. You're begging for rage quits. It's too much. This should be the end of the level, especially since it's only the second level. We're still learning. We don't want to be made to play over and over again. Shoot. That and they're beating up a cute girl in gla with glasses on. Don't you know you don't punch girls? And you don't punch somebody wearing glasses? Come on. That's like the old out. Oh, it's the old out. Oh, I'm wearing glasses. <sighs> Alright, adventure's tough. Give it a couple more attempts, but I don't know, guys. So you should go to two-player games that work right now. <laughs> and look for ragdoll games. The link to the game is in the description also. And let's see if you could get past this. See if you're better than me. You can see right there behind my face. I just took my face away. It says twoplayergames.org on the screen. I have my face right where the uh, their logo is, so I'm gonna have to resolve that. You can find it on your phone. 
Looks like a giant uh, soda bottle, cola bottle, even. Wow. Oh man, can I um? Is there a technique? Do you see how he flew like that? The way he cuts off the ring as if he was a boxer, like when I try to get kind of an, uh, the right angle by stepping around him, and he'll sidestep to, to cut me off, kind of it's like a boxing technique. It's pretty interesting how aggressively they do it. Keep me from getting where I want. Whoa! That really happened? What's the trick to getting them to go flying? Like, so aggressively flying. So you press shift to run. Which is super helpful. Clearing space from the other bad guy. Nice. Problem with that, the fact that you can shoot them so far, is they can do it to you too. Oh, so close. But there's another set of three coming after him. All right, so I need him to go fly, like real far. So we need space. If he's too close to the wall, it doesn't really happen. He doesn't go flying. You hear my... <laughs> hear my... Oh! <laughs> out he goes. He's out of here. He's out of here. Nope. Nope. Not happening. Sorry, buddy. This is the time I'm winning this. So close. I need a running attack. There's no running attack. I need one. What the heck? Is it, am I just choking? Like, am I getting so afraid of the last guy that I'm just not attacking properly? Because he's thrown me out like three times in a row now. I feel like that's what's happening. Come on. No! He goes flying and he hits the door. <laughs> Get up. Get up. Now you can see the two-player games. Dot org logo. Under me right there. I'm floating in thin air. And underneath is the two-player games.org where you can go and play this game. I thought we were glitched out. I thought I was in a lot of trouble. Oh! Well done. And he goes down. Let's catch that again. It's time for an impact replay. He just won't get up. He just won't get up. Then finally he gets up. We start laying the smack down on him. <clears throat> oh, the next level is a different style level. It's like the Street Fighter type level. I think, right? Oh, I don't have to actually pick that up. Just press it. Yeah, nice. This is better. I like this better. I was afraid I was going to have to do like, more punching off the roof. And uh, quite honestly, that was going to not be fun. It's going to get old quick. Being that it's so difficult. But the fact that it was just a one-time level... Uh, now I understand why it was a little bit more difficult and there were a few waves. Well, I am just like... We'll get that box, get that box. Yeah, I got an axe. I got an axe.
<laughs> this is fun. This is well made. I'm always impressed by these guys. And this is a zero dollar game I'm playing on a web browser. Like, what the heck? It's better than it has any right to be. Oh yeah. Oh, slicing and dicing. They don't even stand a chance. Although my health is getting kind of low. Because I haven't paid a whole lot of attention. Look at the guy in the corner his arms just waving around. I haven't paid too much attention to my health, my defensive skills. I've just been assaulting these guys. And I'm getting concerned. Oh, I did it in the first well attempt. This after what, like 12 attempts on the last level? What's the next level all about? This is a battleship. Put your enemies in jail. Use the blue arm. This blue arm rotates the crane. The red arm drops the cage area. Two enemy groups. But um, now we have to uh, start all over again. That makes me sad. They're down. That's it. That's a straight up victory right there, right off the bat. Nice. Now we got the another, the next team here. So the first thing I do is uh, just try to get it where I need it. And then get them where I need them. Right there. Yep. That's it. That's a victory. Awesome. You guys were catching the replay of the first drop. Well, I got the second drop, but uh, there it is. Awesome. So now we have to get them, oh my God, run over by cars, if I understand this correctly. Run over by cars. So. I don't think getting myself run over by a car is a good idea. I don't think that counts as winning. I think I, <laughs> I, think I lose if, they get, if I get hit by a car. Oh, but it's not an instant, it's instant death. Like, so I could lure them out there. If I needed to take a hit for the team, for example. See, my punches don't do any damage to them. But their punches do damage to me. That's interesting. No, 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 no. Get Nope. Eat the car. Stay where you are. No, he went flying forward. That's what I want. They definitely know. <laughs> that was amazing. I need a replay of that. He flew directly into traffic. Did the replay work? Did it trigger? There you go. Here comes the replay. Yes. I'm about to win this, too. I'm sorry, guys. He's about to run over and killed. Yes, it's over. It is over. Oh, there's more guys. Spawned somewhere, and they... They spawned on the road. And they got run over. And murdered all of them before I even got a chance to fight them. Look! Oh! That's a victory right there. I wonder how many waves there are. I'm, I'm thinking three. There were three last time.
brutal. Where are they? Oh, I thought the arrow was telling me that they were that way, but uh, that's just the arrow is just pointing to me. So they could be anywhere. I feel like the game is glitching out because they're all dead. They haven't spawned anywhere. Getting across the street is uh, very difficult. But I've done it. It's like playing Frogger. I think I need to restart because I think there's something wrong here. Oh no, there is another group. You hear them? They're getting run over. Just trying to get to me. There they are. There they are. I'm afraid I'm so close to the end of the map now where the ocean is. I don't want to get myself knocked into the water. It might be an instant death. I'm not really sure. He's in the streets. He's done. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, I did it while getting run over. Too funny. This is the last level. I need to get powerful weapons and kill everybody. That's basically what it said. I love that you can control with the camera. But I wish. It's just too hard to fight and use the camera at the same time. Because playing with two hands is definitely your best bet. Long sword, huh? Oh boy. Wow, I got the right weapon now. It seems like it handles multiple people quite easily. I'm not sure I want to change weapons. It's the same weapon. Ouch. I did it. I finished the game. That's awesome. So now I can play uh, arena mode if I wanted one or two player. And you can just basically pick uh, who you want to be. You pick the stage you want to fight in. And it's a fight like this, which is really cool. And then weapons even even drop, which is cool. Impressive. There's a weapon right there. Slicing and dicing. Excellent. What we got there? The axe. 
<laughs> nice. Just kind of swept him for that win right there. Outstanding. No, I need a weapon. He got the weapon. That's not. Oh, I have it. Let's throw it. Oh, I missed. Sometimes I forget. I can pick stuff up. I <laughs> threw him right in the face. I'm not even sure if you caught that, but him right in the face. Ooh. K.O. Oh. Round three, but I won. Didn't I won both first rounds, or did I not? Am I just totally wrong? I want to hit him in the face, but I keep missing. Should I be fighting him with a, without a weapon when he's got one? No, I should be using a weapon, right? Oh, I punched him clean off the stage. Come on. Mm, that's glitchy glitch. Yeah, I glitched it out. What a bummer. Anyway, guys, so this is uh, twoplayergames.org. Ragdoll games. You can go to twoplayergames.org and pick from dozens of games to play for free. You can, of course, also play this game by clicking the link in my description below. Let me know your thoughts in the comments, and I will catch you next time. Peace out.